What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Be Exclusive. Like I said at the beginning of every one of my videos, I think everyone should be exclusive. Now, um, today's gonna be, or tomorrow, cause I'm filming this at, basically it's, it's about to be 10 o'clock right in one more minute. Well, a couple seconds, cause it's 9.59, but 9.59 on a Friday night. Uh, tomorrow I'm going to an outside range yes we're going to outside range yes i'm excited may not has may not have came off as enthusiastic as you know as i wanted to be but i am excited you know what i mean it's my first time it's gonna be a little chilly out so it's definitely gonna be a challenge um i've got tired of shooting in the inside range to be honest with you you know it's cool because i still get to practice you know but I really, once I experienced the outside range before, I was like, man, you know, it's, it's literally nothing like shooting outside, to be honest with you. It's, it's way more free, you got more space. It just feels better, you know what I mean? It feels more natural. And uh, you won't have uh, that problem just people being right next to you, especially the gun range I go to have the problem of, and it's not even a problem, but it's like something I could do without, but you know, you, you learn to conform and just like, oh, okay, we, I deal with it, but the range I go to, you know, it usually has, you know, every lane is just about filled up, and you know, lane reservations is a, uh, it's a, it's a thing over here where I go to, and uh, this, uh, this range that I'm going to now is first come first serve, so I don't even have to really book the night before. Like right now, I'd be booking to go to get a lane for tomorrow if I was going to my my uh, primary um, range, but. With this range, it's about 45 minutes from my house. I just show up and I'm gonna show up early as possible. As soon as they open them doors, I'm there. And this is my first time going, but you know, I'm, I'm ready to experience uh, an outside range and, and you know, hopefully I enjoy my first time, which I'm pretty sure I will because anywhere I can just shoot guns and you know, it's it's, it's a cool environment, um, you know, I'm there, I'm sticking around. And the people are, are, are cool as well. Hey, that's, that's a plus as well, but um, I'm gonna go there, you know, shoot my PSA dagger. It's like it's butter, man. Honestly speaking, it's butter. It's butter. And there's one thing I do want to change about it, but I've read a couple of reviews, you get what I'm saying? And basically the 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 trigger, I would be putting a Timney trigger in there if I would have put any trigger in there, right? And that was my initial thought. I'm, I'm gonna just throw a Timney trigger in there. That's what I was thinking. I was, then I looked at some reviews and they were saying that you had striking issues or whatnot. A lot of people was complaining about uh, striking issues is their number one issue when they uh, put in a Timney trigger or Apex. And uh, you know, I don't want any. I don't want any 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 issues like that. So I, I can leave it as is and just push rounds through, and then over time it'll lighten up on its own, the natural way, of course. But um, yeah. Uh, like I said, I'm filming this the night before, so we just gonna end this, well not end it here, I'm gonna cut it right here, and then this next clip will be me, you know, at the gun range. So with that being said, I appreciate everybody that's show, been showing support. Um, it's a new year, let's let's keep running it up, um, you know. And, uh, oh yeah, I have a Discord too. I'm gonna put that in the description, either, either this upload or next upload, it just depends how I'm feeling about it. And nah, fuck that. I'm gonna put it in the description um, in this video and anybody's free to join. We we have real, we have different channels, uh, real world topics. You can throw your firearms in there, just show off, you know what I'm saying? And just, you know, show other people what you have. Cause you know, if you're in a gun war, you just like seeing guns. You like seeing other people with guns or firearms, but um, it's multiple channels, actually like six six channels. Uh, but yeah, no further than that, uh, I catch y'all at the gun range. See y'all soon.
last magazine. Back at the pad, you know what I'm saying? Successful day at the gun range or the new gun range. Like I said, this is the outside gun range, about 45 minutes from where I stay at. Um, and I'm gonna be honest with y'all to give y'all a little analysis and a summary of, uh, you know, of shooting the dagger in this new slide. But you two, we are clear. But I do wanna let y'all know that this is gonna be replacing my Glock 19X. And I only say that, and people be like, oh, he's, how you gonna replace the Glock with his clone? I ain't gonna lie, this clone, whatever y'all wanna say, this clone or whatnot, I, I call it by his real name, the dagger. Cause honestly, it's sharp. Hmm, <laughs> just like a dagger. And the reason I, I bring the accuracy is better on this is because the sights, the sights are a lot higher and they're more defined. Like, is this, I don't know, it just shoots better than me. And uh, as you can see by the footage, I was knocking these targets down, man. And and like I said, I was even surprised because I shot a few rounds out of my Glock. I ended up about two magazines out of my Glock 19X. And uh, it was um it was okay. Like my aim wasn't as extravagant as it was with this, so you know what I mean? And luckily my what is it, my Vader or my yeah, my Vader holster, it's it's a lot, it can, it can, uh, not a lot, but it can take my dagger along with my 19X. So the same holster I use for my 19, for my 19X, I can use on my dagger, which is very, very, um, what's the word? It's very, uh, convenient. Yes, it's convenient that that one holster can hold two different type of guns, but it's a clone, so I wouldn't be surprised, and I'm not surprised why I can do, it can hold both. That's why I tried, I'm like, hmm, it's a clone, so this should be able to be, uh, should be able to fit into my, my 19 holster, which it did. And like I said, I'd be carrying this from now on. And believe it or not, even though this is like a sneak, extended mag, it is to a degree, but it's plus five. It's not really a mag extension to that degree. It's only plus five. So I can holster this and it's not printed or uh, showing some type of, you know, outline of a hey, he might have a gun nobody would know um just like if i were to use a regular standard magazine which would be this and i don't mind carrying this but the plus five it just looks better so i'm gonna use that but yeah yeah this this thing shoots like butter i'm not gonna lie i probably gotta get another light for this but we'll see, we'll see. But I know I gotta get a red dot. I don't know when I'm gonna get the red dot, I'm gonna get a red dot for this. A hollow sun to be specific. But no further than that, it's your boy Be Exclusive. And I think everyone should be exclusive. See y'all on the next upload.